Kathleen has been here through the long fight to pass the Affordable Care Act. She helped guide its implementation, even when it got rough. President Obama bidding farewell to Health and Human Services Secretary Kathleen Sebelius. You are now under oath. The face of the administration's rocky rollout of healthcare.gov. Hold me accountable for the debacle. Okay. I'm responsible. Madam and a Secretary, frequent target of Republican right critics now, we'll and no, late night comedy shows like Saturday Night Live, which mock the website's website. problem. How it's been crashing and freezing and shutting down and stalling and not working and breaking and sucking. <laughs> The glitch plague site bedeviled the administration for months, raising doubts about how many people would sign up for insurance by the March 31st deadline. She's got bumps, I've got bumps, bruises. Just Thursday, Sebelius told a congressional much, committee yeah. some 7.5 million people had signed up for coverage, a number the president touted. And they were problems. But under Kathleen's leadership, her team at HHS, turned the corner, got it fixed, got the job done, and the final score speaks for itself. The former Kansas governor spoke about what the HHS post meant to her. Now this is the most meaningful work I've ever been a part of. In fact, it's been the cause of my life. The president named budget director Sylvia Matthews Burwell to replace Sebelius, highlighting her skills as a manager and calling on the Senate to confirm her swiftly. She was confirmed 96 to 0 for her current position last year and needs just 51 votes. Arizona Republican John McCain has already tweeted his support. Still, the confirmation hearing will be one more chance for opponents to bash Obamacare.